Hello everyone, I am Tarun Kumar Jain, a student of the Tankal Mahavir University, Muradabad. This assignment is for the course Machine Learning using Python at SkyFi Labs. So the assignment is related to make the prediction of Boston House data sets that are already present in Scikit-learn library. Now getting started by importing all the required modules for this project. After importing the modules, we will load the Boston dataset. Now to know the details of dataset, we can use describe function which contains the information about the features and attributes that are present in the dataset. After getting the dataset in the form of numpy array, so we now need to convert it into data frames in order to manipulate the features or the target variable. So we will load the features into features data frame and same with the target data frame. As we are dealing with the supervised machine learning models which requires the features or the labels. To use our data set, we now have to concatenate these features and target variable in the form of data frames. We would like to explore the data, so the basic model is to call the describe function which give the basic information of mean, minimum, max, etc. To know about the shape of the data, we will call the shape function. As we can see, there are 506 rows and 14 columns including target variable. Now we would like to find the null values in the data set. So as we can see there are no null values. We would also like to check the data types. So every column is in float data type. Now for the data visualization we can see the univariance visualization where we are plotting particular features individually to see the distribution using this plot. Now we would like to explore the columns against the target variable we will use red plot. So in the plot we can see the state show good relation with the target variable. Now we would start our data modeling. First we would like to find which feature has the highest correlation with the target variable. So we will use Pearson correlation where we can see that L state has the highest correlation with the target variable. Now we can use simple linear regression model as we have only one feature which is required for linear regression. For linear regression, we will importing the pre-built model from scikit-learn library. Now we will define the x variable and y variable or the dependent variable and independent variable. For train test split, I have kept the test size to 20% and rest 80% for the training set. Now we will create our linear regression object. Then we will call the fit method to fit the training data to predict the values of test data. Now we would like to check the scores. So as we can see, the score is about 61% and same with the mean square error we can see it is about 37%. So that's all we have done with our project. Thank you.